Okay, and now we're back, so let's continue. So that was a uh, a great episode before this one, where we were able to see a heartwarming, uh, not a heartwarming, but a something like a an emotional sequence right there or um, what you call this an emotional uh, scene with Jesse and uh, Biggs before that Wedge before that so yep uh, but right now uh, probably we may have to heal first or rest first because it may seem that we are gonna fight a boss or something like that. So here we go. I done with you yet. You hear me? Think you can come up in here, do what you want. We gonna take it. Barry. Get your ass back up. Now, the is gonna chew you up! Still alive and kicking? Damn right! Leading man sticks around to the credit roll! Though so we gotta keep moving if we wanna make it that far. You ready? Yep. Personal, bitch. Awaiting confirmation. Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. <laughs> yeah, yeah, coming right up. Yeah? No, you don't. Not when I'm working. <laughs> Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. Press it. Now, now. You ain't got shit on us. Oh, 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 careful. He's quick. Yeah, quick and run it away, baby. I got you. I got you. I got you. All right. Yeah. Watch and learn. Yeah. I'm counting Let's on you. So, heard you give room. Let me. No choice, huh? I guess I need that one more. Hang in there! Get my turn! Bring it home! Taking over. I'm still paying attention. Take the lead. Come on! Yeah! I'll do it! You're up! Let's do this. I'm waiting. Keep it together. Yeah. 
wings, huh? I was planning to join you anyway. <laughs> Any landing you can walk away from. <laughs> Come on, let's teach them the Turks two step. <laughs> what happens when you mess with the Turks? <laughs> hey, yeah, uh, look at Rocky now. You're going down. You're going to yeah. fight with the Turks. You better be prepared to leave in a body bag. <laughs> You're a confident ass! <laughs> Want some more? <laughs> I got <laughs> Help! Fight <laughs> through it. Steady. I won't give up. After you. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> I got this. I got this. Watch yourself. All right. Give them hell. My turn. Duty calls. How do we stop it? <laughs> Who knows? Where are you going? Separation imminent. Evacuate immediately. Late separation initiated. You son of a bitch! What have you done?!
What do we do? <sighs> nothing. There is nothing you can do now. You can't do this! Eva! <gasps> I found Marlene! Aerith! Marlene? My Marlene? What did you do with her? <sighs> Where are you? I'm at the... Sir, you're on. Your activities unwittingly brought you into contact with the Ancient, who is now back in our custody where she belongs. For this, you have my sincere gratitude. Alas, the sector in which you stand has been condemned. Ancient? Run! You have to go now! And where exactly do you expect them to go? Uh, Aerith! A total plane separation imminent. Evacuate the area immediately. No, no, no. If we don't get the hell out of here right okay. now, we're dead. We have to go out. Yeah. Gotta get out of here now. 20 more seconds. Hey! Over here! Found us a way out! Tifa. Come on! Come on! Anybody out there? Barrett! I think I hear him up ahead. Hey! Can anybody goes. hear and me? And push! God damn you! God 
God damn you all! Molly. Molly. It was us. We did this. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before it was Shinra that pulled the trigger today. Am I right? Barrett. Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith? Is that the girl they took? Yeah. That's her. Hmm. What the hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. And she did. You sure? Hey, where are you going? Okay, so yep, here we are. This sector is in rubbles. How could this happen? And uh, the scene right there where um, Barrett, Cloud, and Tifa uh, was. Uh, I don't know how you call that, riding or moving away from the plate. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. Hey Tifa, know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. Failed again, I see. But through. 
through suffering, you will grow strong. Isn't that what you want? Cloud? Hmm? It's nothing. Let's go. Okay, so yes, uh, as I was saying earlier, hang on. Hey, pretty crazy, huh? Can you believe this mess? You doing all right? I am, but I can't say the same about my birds. Poor things are scared half to death. Okay, again, as I was saying earlier with regards to the scene where uh, Barrett was holding on to something and um, Tifa and Cloud was riding at the back of him. Over there. So... What the hell are they doing here? We Their jobs, probably. Yeah, um, just focus that on scene also was again. can Nothing be found else. with the old or the OG Final Fantasy VII, and uh, I'm just thankful that that scene was right right there was uh, also uh, put in right the, here in this game. So again, uh, let's interact with him. Did you find what you were looking for? Thanks to you, I did. Good. Now never let it go again. So uh, I'm gonna check uh, some stores to see if what we can buy. Hey there, we're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff too. I uh, just want to make sure if we're Thanks good, and I think uh, there's nothing that we can buy right here. But how about? Can we? I think we can't get in there. Found them. We're searching the compound as we speak, sir. Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. Is it true that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? You guys run into Jesse at the villa? Yeah. Biggs, too. They were let both in pretty bad shape. Throw, in but Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Uh, can we find something here? Ooh, okay. What's this? Star pendant. Anything else? Okay. I've been thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. Uh, it's just a nostalgic with regards to where we are right now. In this, in the story of the game, so yeah, I can remember this the way That's back, nineteen ninety-seven. That's about, or My almost, ears a, are still uh, from thirty it. years now. So yeah. This is Sector Five, right? So where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then, pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. Um. Did a plate really fall? Uh, anything that we can buy right here? Nah. Okay. World's just too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at yourself. <laughs> What can we mm -hmm. get here? Items? Nah. See ya. How about this one? Cloud, I'm glad to see that you're okay. In these trying times, I hope to develop new materia to help us endure.
Okay, so... What can we buy? Item Master. Uh, we don't own this. Okay, we'll just buy one for now and this as well. Uh, stead, steadfast block. Less damage. Uh, I think that's all that we need for now. I believe. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it. Oh, okay. So, what do we need to do? A stagger effect. MP cons comes. I mean, consumption. Okay, we need six more for this. Hmm. Okay. How about the health that we have? It seems that it has been um, restored. So we'll just go directly to uh, Eric's house right now. We'll try to check if uh, Marlene's there or anything that we can get out of or any information out of uh, That's the house Marlene! Marlene! Out of Ilmira, I believe If I'm right If, I, if my memory still serves me right or Where's Marlene? Something. Is she here? Barrett! Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Uh, 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 Marlene, she's got short hair. She's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing she's a pink dress today. She's sleeping upstairs. Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. Uh. I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Okay. Thank you, Elmira. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. <sighs> Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. <sighs> About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But, he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. 
But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went, to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. <laughs> My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories, like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility, and how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no, this one, right here. I mean, what can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. You know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <sighs> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! But Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest, and that they'll send her straight back home once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. 
if I lost her too. I don't know if I could, if I could ever. Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so... Yep, uh, here we are... We know now of uh, what uh, Aerith's story is. So, uh, for now, though, uh, I may have to stop uh, this uh, playthrough for now. Uh, I will be uh, continuing the series still. But, uh, yep, I would just like to thank everyone for watching. And uh, hopefully, you'll still be there up until the end of this series. Because uh, I will continue and make sure that uh, we'll, uh, we'll finish this game. So, yep, uh, thank you so much for watching. And this has been J-Cord. See you again next time. And bye for now.